Hey again, it's Ashley from Live Happy Tarot. I'm trying to get myself to start using an intro to my videos on my channel. We do a lot of tarot and oracle deck walkthroughs. I am a collector. My collection is growing. I love to share my collection. I also do a card uh, pick a pile reading. I try to do that every Wednesday. Um, and sometimes I do other videos that are fun. So if you enjoy tarot and oracle cards or collecting such things, please follow me and subscribe to my channel. And I really appreciate you being here. Thank you. Hi, everybody. Okay, this is Ashley from Live Happy Tarot. I have a deck I wanted to review. Sorry, I'm, I'm not as organized as I would like to be. Um, I bought the Witchy Cat from Dame Darcy. Um, it just came in and I'm super excited. I've already started using it. So just so you know, um, it's not going to be in order. Um, but this is the deck we're going to use and we're going to walk through it. We're going to check it out. First, we'll talk about the box. I ripped the box just trying to get the cards out. This is why I don't like tuck boxes. Can you see, right? Just a tiny rip, but it's so annoying. Like it, this box is super tight. Like even now trying to get the cards open was super sticky, which is really annoying. But here's the box. Here's the card backs. These are the decks that Dame Darcy does. Here is Dame Darcy. <laughs> do you guys keep these extra cards with your tarot decks or do you pull them aside? I tend to pull them aside because sometimes I forget I have them and then I'll shuffle them into the deck and then I'll be like pulling cards and I'll get, you know, this one and I'll be like, what? Which, um, but I don't know. What, what do you guys do? Let me know. So this is just a regular tarot card size. This is one from This Might Hurt and they're basically the exact same size. They are, I really need to learn more about my card stock, but they're a little bit shiny. You see, but not too bad. And they're like pretty good. Like I feel like you could totally shuffle them. Uh, let, let's try. Oh, I, oh, they shuffle really well. So that's nice. So they're like average cardstock. I have no idea. I don't know what to call it. All right. So what we're going to do is I'm going to do the flip, flip the camera and we're going to walk through the cards. Thanks. Okay, hopefully you can see these cards. Last time I did a walkthrough, I, I noticed that um, I kind of felt like the cards were getting cut off a little bit. But these are the cards for the witchy cat. You'll notice that they're all black. I mean, they're black bordered, but the sides are white. Like these are definitely some that would do really well with like um, doing the edging, maybe purple, maybe black, I'm not sure. I am so not into edging because it's scary for me. I feel like I'm going to ruin the deck. But some of the people are, well, I guess the more practice you have, the more, the better you would get at it, right? All right. So here's the deck. They are not in order. I did want to say, I just wanted to read what um, she says on the back of the, the box. The witchy cat was inspired by Basat, the, ooh, I can't read that. The something... Egyptian goddess of abundance. The, I don't know, it's in, it's in cursive. I don't know what that says. So it's inspired by the Basat. The deck was drawn in the memory of my childhood. Kitty named Licorice, which I had a kitty, actually it was my sister's cat, but her cat was named Licorice, it was a black cat. So here we go. This is the Eight of Swords. The Four of Swords. The Queen of Wands. This one I really love. I love the sunflowers on this one. King of Wands. Ace of Pentacles. This one's beautiful too. I really like the Black Kitty. Two of Pentacles. Eight of Wands. I have to say I love the kitties. I'm not a huge fan of like the mix of the cat people, but... Queen of Cups. Well, I like this one perhaps better than this one. I don't know. King of Cups. I'm sorry. I can really read Knight of Cups. 
Queen of Pentacles, Nine of Wands, Ten of Wands, The World. This looks like my doggy. Ace of Cups. Oh. Nine of Swords. Five of Swords. Ace of Wands. Oh, she's interesting. Two of Wands. Oh. Six of Swords. I thought I looked through quickly and they were all upright. I apologize. Seven of Swords. That looks like the Cowardly Lion to me from Dorothy and the Wizard of Oz. Ace of Swords, Three of Wands, this one's pretty, Four of Wands, Five of Wands, Six of Wands, I like the kitties in this one and the flowers, there's one, okay, one, oh, there's another kitty, two, three, four, five, six, Seven of Wands, Two of Swords, I feel like you're they're drinking martinis. Judgment. The moon. The sun. I love the sun card. The moon, not so much. Three of swords. Oh my goodness. Strength. The hermit. Seven of cups. How many choices? Wheel of Fortune, Justice, Ugh. Eight of Cups, oops, nope, the Hanged Man, isn't that funny? Death, Nine of Cups, Temperance, The Devil, Ten of Cups. To tower. Oh. The Star. Hmm. Page of Cups. King of Cups. The Chariot. Oh, that's interesting. I think that's the Sphinx, correct? The Lovers. Three of Cups, Four of Cups, The Emperor, The Hierophant, Five of Cups, Rah! that's what he looks like he's saying, Six of Cups, Nine of Pentacles, Ten of Pentacles, Knight of Swords, Two of Cups, The Fool, Page of Pentacles, I flipped those all over and probably they'll, oh, okay, good, Knight of Pentacles, King of Pentacles, King of Swords, okay, we'll flip them back over, Queen of Swords, the Magician, Three of Pentacles, Four of Pentacles, Five of Pentacles, Six, Seven, you can tell where how I shuffled, right? The High Priestess, the Empress, the Eight of Pentacles, Page of Wands, the Ten of Swords, the Knight of Wands, and the Page of Swords. So I'm going to pull out, so th these are the cards that I look at. I like to look at the High Priestess, and I like to look at the Queens when I first get a deck. Um, I think the Fool is an interesting card here. I, there, this is a differently drawn deck.
anyway, that's my walkthrough of The Witchy Cat by Dame Darcy. Hope you enjoyed seeing all the cards, and I'll see you next time.